d bob is wavelength of electron d bob is wave So D Boglis wavelength uh, so lambda is equal to so Planck constant by momentum we know H Planck constant 6.626 into 10 to the power of minus 34 joule so P momentum so momentum means P is equal to force into time taken so force F is equal to MA according by Newton second law of motion so now we replace it F is equal to MA into time taken where a is velocity by time taken so now we can return as m velocity by time taken into time taken so it cancel so momentum is equal to m now we can return as lambda equal to h by m b take its equation 1 let's uh, determine the velocity of the electron velocity of the electron now kinetic energy of mv square equal to 1 electron volt so v square so m in getting divided to 2 electron volt by m therefore v equal to root of 2 ev by m so take its equation 2. Now substitute the equation 2 in equation 1. So therefore lambda equal to h by m. Now we, we value is root of 2 ev by m. 2 ev by m. So, so m can return as root m into root m. So lambda equal to h m root m into root m into 2 ev by m 1 cancel m m cancel it's okay now look here now lambda equal to h by root of um, 2 m e v okay now m is mass is constant ev okay ev that is kinetic energy e is equal k is equal to e electron volt okay therefore lambda equal to h by 
root of 2 m k okay so equation 3 so this equation to determine the wavelength of the electron okay so units meter thank you